guys welcome back i hope your day is going well my day's going pretty good let's see here don't have any shotgun shells. Actually, I don't know why I put that back. I'm gonna take that, that. Um, I'm gonna pick up this as well. Um, I think I'm gonna put the shotgun. Well. You know, I'll also pick up these because I think I can use them. Maybe. We'll see. No, you know what? I think I'm actually going to put them back until I'm ready to go. There. Yeah. Okay. We'll try this. We'll try it this way. Um, it's sealed firmly. Wait, so were we not supposed to come here? Because I'm not prepared. Okay, well I guess we can try. I guess, right? It's early enough in the game. If I die, I die. It's not... I mean, we're only in this for a minute. So far, what, two minutes? I think we'll be fine. Let's... I only have 15 shell... or, um, bullets. I don't have any shotgun shells. Right. If he jumps out, we'll just run. Okay, we're missing one. Okay. Makes me nervous. Ada? Ah, oh, there she is. I don't think I've introduced myself yet. My name's Leon. I'm with the RPD. It's a dead end. You think we can get upstairs through this shaft? Give me a boost. I'll go and check. Right. What do you have? Um, it's already fully loaded. What is this? No, not come out. I want to check. Picture taken fairly recently. Okay. Oh, um... Quickly reload. Oh my word, okay. Um, I remember playing like with Sherry, she does not get any type of weapons to run through that area. And they have dogs there, so that's not going to be very fun. There's a sewage disposal map. Of course I'll take it. Um, let's jump down here. I don't like the way that Ada has straight leggings under her dress. I don't like the way it looks. 
can't jump up here. There we go. And there we go. Okay. Um, I think that's too far. We'll try this. No, Ada, just thank you. this anymore? Okay. Snug as a bug. Fingers crossed this fits. Okay. Can we, there we go. A lever to fill and drain water. Will you move it? Oh, sweet. Oh, um, right. So that means Mr. X pop up in RPD2? Well, I guess we're still technically in the police station. else down here? Uh, the water pipe is under construction. Is that it? Uh oh. Okay. I'm guessing there's nothing else. Got it. Can you hear me? Ada, did you find anything? Right here. Think fast. Here's one more. Hey, I can't reach the ventilation hole. I'm going to have to find another way around. I'll catch up with you later. What? Ada, wait! Well then, uh, yes. Mm, yes, okay. Am I mad with that? Oh, um... Did I put the shutters up? Oh, of course you're down! Oh my word, I... Their tippy taps sound cute, but then you look at them and they look like utter dreams. Um, I kind of want to see what's down here. Can I? Scary. Okay. All that for a red herb. Um, I'm I was I I knew that was gonna happen and I wasn't prepared for it. Oh my word! Um, I opened the map instead of aiming. Um, that's the map. Oh goodness. Oof. All right, heart attack central. Heart attack central. That's. Can I open this? I can't open that one. Is there anything in here? Nothing. So all that. Two shotgun shells for a red herb. Um, I'm not down. That was a waste. That was a complete and utter waste. Uh, 
vent doesn't have anything else, so let's go back this way. Oh no. Um he's right there. Oh you know what? I'm gonna do something very stupid, very crazy. <laughs> So we're out of shotgun shells again, you guys. Um, I know, very smart of me, right? Um, is there another one here? No, okay, I think we can run. Ooh, that was scary. Oh, my word, that scared me. I picked up the shotgun shells there. Anything on this table? Anything in these lockers? Nothing in this locker. Nothing in this locker. Ooh, yes. Nothing in this locker. Okay, well, I'll take it. Nothing useful. Oh, I see feet. Are you gonna get up? No, do you have anything? His throat and abdomen have been torn out. Ooh! Oh, we'll not say no to that. Watchman's Diary. August 11th. I finally had the chance to see blue skies for the first time in ages, but it did a little to lift my- but it did little to lift my spirits. I was reprimanded by the chief for neglecting my duties while I was up on the clock tower. There's only one thing I still don't understand. The chief seemed to be more concerned about the fact that I was up on the tower rather than that I was neglecting my duties. Why was access to the tower prohibited in the first place anyway? September 5th. I recently talked to the old man who works in the scrapyard out back. His name is Thomas. He's a quiet man and really seems to enjoy chess. He even went uh, so far as to design a special key unlock engraved with the chess pieces on them for one of the doors in the disposal yard. We made plans to play chess tomorrow night. I can't help but wonder how good he is. One thing that's been bothering me about him is, is the way that he's always scratching himself. Does he have some sort of skin disease or is he just rude? September 9th. Thomas was a much better player than I had imagined. I used to think of myself as a fairly decent player. But he did a pretty good job of humbling me. About the only thing I imagine um, that could match his skills in chess is his appetite. All the guy could talk about was food throughout the entire game. He sounded fairly healthy, but didn't look quite right. I wonder if he's okay. September 12th. I was supposed to play another game of chess with Thomas, but we had to cancel because he hasn't been feeling too well. He stopped by to see me, but I told him to go back and rest since he literally looked like the walking dead. He insisted that he was just fine, but I could tell he was really having problems. Come to think of it, I haven't been feeling too good myself lately. Oh, sucks. Um, right, 
Right. Alright, when does this go? Oh, my word. This is quite scary. Not prepared for any of this. Is the next precinct key? I think I had look it up. He's still alive, still moving his head around. I think it's this way. Right, um, I think this is the room where Mr. X pops in. Um, I don't know if I want to deal with this right now, hold on. Are there any other rooms that we can use this key in? PlayStation Basement 1, so we don't have that key card just yet. I have to say that's unlocked. There's another place I can use this key. I'm trying to think where. Where can I use this key? Um, we're gonna come back here. Run around the, uh, the police station. I think going up we'll have liquors now. Um, let's go this way. Oh, I don't like that music. Why is that music there? Excuse me. down. The lock is broken and can't be opened. Okay, I think I checked everything here, did I? Nope. Uh... Come over here, buddy. I finally got something for you. Is he coming? So we'll take that film. Nothing else? Okay. Alright, 
Alright, let's go develop this film and drop off that magnum. Where's the special key for those lockers? I don't ever remember special- no. I don't remember ever any ever special keys. I can't English today, clearly. I'll be right there, we'll bring you all the way up here. I'll keep the shells and we'll develop that film. I actually might save too. I can develop film here. Film A. A Birkin arm. Code G human body experiment. September 15th. 1524. 1500 hours, 24 minutes, that's how, I don't know how to say, say that exactly. Yeah, let's go ahead and save. Maybe there's something there. I think it might be, I might be wrong. What is it this one down here? Oh, it's already unlocked. What's in here? I can't remember. Oh. Anything in oh, this is that library. We can never go down that hallway again. There has to be another place that I can use this key. Oh, yep, there's liquors. I That was very scary. Um, I think I wasted a shell there. Is there another one? I think there's another one. Neil's looking at something. No, maybe not. There can't just be only one up here. Maybe there is. Oh wow, okay. is in that basement. In that parking garage basement. Let me go back down there. I just want to do that that room last. So I really don't want Mr. X following me around. I mean, he is no matter what. It just, it just makes me nervous.
Oh, please do not tap out on me. Um, that's the autopsy room. Everyone there is awake. Oh, we haven't gone down here yet. There's gonna be dogs down here. I have two shells. Um. Yes. You hear them? They jumped right down. Oh, I don't think there's anything down here. Right. There's nothing down here for us. <laughs> Great. Let me get a green herb real fast because I have a feeling I'm going to get bit. I feel like I'm just wasting time now because I don't know where where else I can use this key. Because I'm really just trying to avoid Mr. X as long as possible. But that's... Miss Strikes coming into this game is inevitable. I think I just have to rip the band-aid right off. Oh! That was real close. Okay, so we've been in the autopsy room, right? <laughs> I still... why is it blank? Is there... am I missing something in there? Oh. Oh! I was blinking because I had the key! All these guys are gonna get up. Quickly, Leon. Wait, are they not getting up? Am I missing something? Hold on. What? Was there something in there where the lid popped off? Was it, um... I remember them waking up. Did they not... Wait, okay, well, I guess they don't wake up. The power to the card reader is on. Oh, I didn't pick up the key card. That's why they didn't get up. It's because I didn't grab the key card. I picked it up and then immediately put it down like an idiot. Yeah. Take the key card and Whew. See that's what I was waiting for. That was nerve wracking. Nerve I don't know how to nerve wracking. I think that's the the term, the phrase. Oh. There's a machine gun and a side pack. With a side pack, I can carry more items. Will you equip it? Um, I think I'll take the side pack and leave the machine gun for player. Yeah. Side pack is being equipped. Which 
probably leave it for Claire. No, I guess we'll leave it. Yes. Take all of this because I need all of it. Well, and I should combine these two. Yes. Okay. I guess now we can go and do that room with Mr. X. Is it this way? Yeah, it's this way. Wait, no, that's to the... Come on, I need to go the other way. That zip zap, I it makes me nervous. It makes me really nervous. All right, now let's go to that teal color door. Mm, I should probably save real fast. Hold on. Because I don't want to fight Mr. X and then die. I have not saved him this time. get those special keys for those lockers. Try this. I don't really want to, but this makes me nervous. Okay, alright, so let's I guess rip the band-aid off. Because there's nothing else I can do. So I have no choice. Hmm. Can I pick up anything in here first? light a fire here. Okay. Um, I guess I should have read this before I went over there. Picture of a man on a carriage. Something is on the wheel. Light the queen, the king, and the jack. Then the carriage will start running. Okay. So the queen, I'm guessing, is this one. What do you mean I don't need to do that right Oh, button. Yes. Um, I guess this is the king. 11. I don't know what the number is. 
numbers have to do with it, but okay. Oh, that's incorrect. Um, this one? Oh, okay. Pick it up. Oh. Wait. Wait, um... I thought Miss Strikes bust through that, that wall. I'm... a little confused now. My memory of this game is that once you pick up that wheel, he busts through that wall. So I'm a little relieved, but then I'm also still on edge because now I don't know when he's gonna pop up. Um, I need to pull up. Come on, Leon. Let's. There we go. Did I Okay, so now I'm just gonna be further on edge for the rest of the game. So, done with that. I think we need to go up one. Um, okay, and then we can put this right there. Looks like a switch, yes. I will. So is that it? No. No stress for the first portion? No, I'm... No! Get away! No! No! Gross. Um, so I'm gonna leave him. No, Leon, you don't need to do anything. You, you, no. You don't need to go back to Ben. You don't need to do anything. We can just continue with our mission and ignore him. He's dead already. He's gone. Dunzo. Ben! Can you still hear me? Come on, answer! Damn! I don't believe this. I almost got the story. <coughs> ben. Uh, <laughs> Bitter irony. The chief of police, a co-conspirator. Oh, get that scum. Make him pay. Hang in there, Ben. Oh! My chest! It's burning! What's wrong? <laughs> Gross. Good God, what was that? 
I find it funny how Leon just watched this thing just squirm away. Like, no big deal. Um, mail to the chief. To Mr. Brian Iron, chief of the Raccoon City Police Department. We have lost the mansion lab facility due to the actions of the new renegade operative, Albert Wesker. Fortunately, his interference will have no lasting effects upon our continued virus research. Our only present concern is the presence of the remaining STARS members, Redfield, Valentine, Burton, Chambers, and Vickers. If it comes to light that the STARS have any evidence as to the activities of our research, dispose of them in, in such a manner that would appear to be purely accidental. Continue to monitor their progress and make certain their knowledge does not go public. Annette will continue to be your contact through this affair. William Bergen. Um, I have deposited the amount of U.S. $10,000 to the account for your services this term as per our agreement. The development of the G-Virus scheduled to replace the T-Virus is near completion. Once completed, I am certain that I will be appointed to be a member of the executive board for Umbrella Incorporated. It is imperative that we proceed with the extreme caution. Redfield and the remaining STARS members are still attempting to uncover information on the project. Continue to monitor their activities and block all attempts to investigate the underground research facility. William Birkin. Um, to Mr. Brian Irons. We have a problem. I received information informing me that Umbrella HQ has sent spies to recover my research on the G-Virus. There are an unknown number of agents involved. They must not be allowed to take this project away from me as it represents my entire life's work. Search the city thoroughly for any suspicious person. Detain any such individuals by whatever means deemed necessary and contact me immediately through Annette. With these precautions, any possible threat should be eliminated. I will not allow anyone to steal my work on the G-Virus, not even Umbrella. William Birkin. Where are you going, Ada? To the chemical plant. I have a feeling that's where I'll find John. Ada! Wait! Hey! Do you read me, Claire? We now have access to the back of the parking lot. Got it. I'm getting out of here and heading to the sewer. Can you meet me there? I'm on my way. She sounds so sad when she says, I'm on my way. You can't put a little pep in your step there, Claire. Just a little bit. The tiniest amount. Um, let's see what he's got going in his cell. Anything of use. Not a single thing. I got it. Okay. Alright, well, let's go through the tippy tap demons once more. Yes, please go down the ladder. Oh, oh. Of course I am. Okay, let's take... I'll do another... I can't combine it. 
Pictured in front of the Aruka's tailor, regress into a zombie within two hours. Subject repeatedly complained about severe agitation of the epidermis in addition to feeling of nausea. This happened up to the moment he lost consciousness. Picture by Art Lambert. That was it? Okay. Um, well I guess we might have to come back because I want that key. we'll try it with this um just go ahead and equip that start off with that that's because it's safe all right let's let's attempt this Okay, well, I guess they're just going to jump on me, whether I like it or not. Their description for the plugs. King plug, rook plug, bishop, knight. Well, let me go back and save, too. 
oh, you know, I think it's okay. I think it'll be fine. That boss battle wasn't uh, too big. Ada. Actually, you know what? Yeah. What was that all about? Running off like that was reckless and stupid. Those zombies are everywhere. Not to mention that thing that got Ben. I was there, Leon. I know. Look, Ada. As an officer, it's my job to look out for you. But we're not going to get through this alive if we don't work together. Okay? All right. We'll do this your way for now. Okay, hold on. I actually need to go drop some stuff off. Because I don't know if there's any stuff to pick up. Like, I know there's any stuff to pick up, but I don't know how much stuff that needs to be picked up. I really thought we were supposed to fight William Burke in there. My memory, is it just serving me wrong on how this game goes? Well, I guess I did not need to put drop stuff up because I had those two extra slots, but I'm gonna take this. Yeah. So now I'm a little conf well, a lot of confused. <laughs> Yeah, I'm like really confused now. This tyrant didn't pop up when I remember him popping up. And we didn't fight in there like I thought we would. Maybe it's just my imagination. I don't know. Alright, yeah, let's jump on in. Let's continue forth. Ooh. I won't say no to these. Manager facts. User list of the connected facility. On the first and third Wednesday of the month, Angelica Margaret, Chief of Maintenance, will make use of the facilities. Be sure to reduce the moisture levels in the facility by activating the fan, as the equipment she will be using is susceptible to the effects of water vapors. On the 28th of every month, the chemical transporter, Don Weller, will use the facility. The chemicals he will be transporting are extremely volatile. Volatile. Extreme caution should be observed throughout their transport. On the 6th and 16th of every month, Police Chief Brian Irons will visit the facility to attend the regular meetings that take place in the lab. On the 4th Friday of every other month, William Birkin will be, uh, ooh, will use the facility to conduct a training seminar for the Chicago branch of Umbrella Incorporated. As the probability of an attack upon Dr. Birkin will be high, take every measure conceivable to guard his life. You will be informed of all other potential visitors and the times they will arrive as needed. Guide these individuals to their destination safely. We expect nothing but the best from you. Charles Coleman, Secretary Chief of Umbrella Headquarters. Anything here? I know I can push this bad boy out of the way. The way Leon looks at her. Like, you gonna help? The storage? Yes. Can I not? Oh, yes. Go down the ladder. Ooh. Plenty of fuel remains. 
Oh yes, I will. I will never say no to Magnum Bullets. The bigger the boom, the happier I am, I guess. Too dark to see anything. Another oil lamp. Yes. Okay, anything else? Nothing else, okay. I'm guessing that's it. Just combine that real quick. Well, I guess it's just one bullet. Never mind. I guess. Well, I take those. I'll leave that. Let me go ahead and save. Um, we've been going for about an hour now, so I think that is a good stopping point. I really hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day, and I will see you next time. Bye.